First of all, I'd like to describe marriage as that of like climbing a mountain. And what you will do, you will tie yourself to a companion and you'll start up the mountain of life. As a child comes along, you tie them to mom and dad and you continue your journey. They will be totally dependent on you for a period. The ropes will hold all of the mountain climbers together, but there are many elements, the wind and the rain, the snow and the ice. All the elements of the world will tear at you to pull you off that eternal mountain. How do you reach the summit? If either mom and dad cut the rope, which binds them, the chances are that one or the other may fall off the mountain and you pull the rest of the family with you. Let us always be mindful also that you represent possibly as older brothers and sisters. You are tied also on this mountain team that's attempting to return back into the presence of your heavenly father. And if you cut the road that binds you between mom and dad or the younger brothers and sisters behind you and you should fall off the mountain, the chances are that you'll take one or two of your brothers or sisters with you. Lift me and I'll lift thee and we'll ascend together. That's the message. A marriage partnership is not a crutch. You do not marry somebody who you think is a little higher than the angels and then lean on them and slow them down. You develop yourself and your own gifts and talents. As she develops hers, you develop yours. And then you grow together.